Hello, I'm Jerry Ford. I'm going to do a sardine review. And it's, I'm kind of, I've got it, I'm kind of prepared here. Um, it's almost like I'm getting, excuse me, I'm getting ready to do surgery, okay? Um, excuse me. Um, okay, so the last experience I had with one of these oval cans, those of you that saw it, was a mess. There's some nasty stuff on there. <clears throat> Just a minute. <clears throat> so, these, these oval cans, the problem with them that is that hand, a lot of hand can openers, at least the cheaper ones, they're not capable of, of following the curves, you know, these, these sharp curves up here. Gross. <clears throat> okay. Thought I cleaned them good when we got it. See that dirty spot right there? Came off of it. Okay, so hold on to that. I dry it off. Get this wipe residue off of here. <clears throat> now. <clears throat> Alright, so. <clears throat> I got some I got I got a couple rubber gloves <laughs> I got a couple rubber gloves um it's a couple of old ones you know got paper towels already ripped already ripped off so I don't have to handle the roll let me get a couple more because it just this it just causes a mess because bad thing is is I, I can't <clears throat> I am um, I can't get the lid all the way off it's it, it stays connected in these two areas at least the other one did so we're gonna find out if it happens again I'm gonna get my I had I got my my knife last time my regular stainless steel knife if that's what it is I don't know um, so let me get that ready here. Okay, am I ready? <clears throat> Trash can right here for drippage. The pliers, I don't know if I'm going to need them or not, but... Um, okay. This is California Girl Sardines and Spicy Tomato Sauce. The other one I did was kind of the same thing, only a different brand. And I can't remember what the name of it was. Um, it's showing yeah, the spice level on here, like a medium. See right there. <clears throat> um, <clears throat> ingredients, sardines, tomato sauce, ground red chili powder, and salt. Product of Ecuador. Wild caught, distributed by Atlap, Atlap, Atlapic Trading Company. Atlapac. Atlapac Trading Company. Santa Fe Springs, California. I think what I'm going to go ahead and do, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and take this label off because um, <clears throat> it gets nasty. Because it drips down it. And I, I'm, I, might want this, I might want this information for to upload with. So I'm going to take it off. Do it without it getting all tore up. I will try to remember to put in the description that you can fast forward to the actual review because this I knew this was going to take a little bit <clears throat> to get ready to do this. 
it was just such a mess last time. I don't want to get this all over everything and if I'm not careful it will happen. So uh, I'm just trying to go in carefully this time. <clears throat> Took my, my guest calendar away. Okay. Let's see. Let me put these on. Because I can't touch anything. If I get it on my hands, I, I can't, I literally cannot touch anything. Watch it go smoothly. It would figure, wouldn't it? Okay, here we go. This is my last one, my last sardine. <clears throat> We got it pierced. Okay. Okay, we're coming up on the turn. I'm gonna have to set it on the desk because I'm afraid it will fall into the trash can. I can even get one side done. I think it did it. Why did it do this one and not the other one? The other one that I did it had metal fragments all over the top and stuff. And uh, I was afraid I was going to eat that. It's taken this other turn, I think. I think it did. Well, I'll be. That's unbelievable. Unbelievable. If I got all prepared for nothing. Let me get a plastic fork out. Don't think I'm going to need these now. I mean, you would think they would make, you know, they would design can openers to handle pretty much any can. All right. So, got a little tomato sauce running down the side here. Get it up here on my plate. doing? What was I going to do? Okay. Oh, I was going to show you. Mm. 
All right, so I really need my plate. Let me set it off the plate. All right. So let's let's check this out. has a, a nice aroma. There's lots of, you know, bones and, and spinal cords and a little bit of viscera, viscera but um, um, it's not, <clears throat> it doesn't look too bad. Let's see. Hmm. pretty good that's pretty good um nice tomato sauce the um the sardines are tender they're not mushy they're just a good tender texture mm-hmm Oh yeah, that's really good. That's really good. Hmm, just getting a little bit of spiciness. There's a little spinal cord. Let me just see what that's all about. That's pretty good. Mm-hmm. That's pretty good stuff. <clears throat> Got some club crackers here. I'm trying to <clears throat> trying to eat up some on my plate. Take this little chunk, a couple little chunks there, and let's take this one, put it on this one, and let's take This one, put it over here, and then let's take this one. It has a big old chunks in here. Let's put it on this one. Okay. Now let's just try it on a cracker, just like this. That's really good. Mm-hmm. That's good on there. The tomato sauce seems to be a pretty good quality tomato sauce. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> yeah, spicy tomato sauce. <clears throat> um, it's not a medium heat like it indicates on here. So far, anyway, not for me. in the middle of the thermometer. Mm. 
Um, what did it say? Yeah, salt. It is salty. Chili powder. I'm getting a little bit the taste, but the tomato sauce is pretty overpowering. Uh, I get the effects of the chili powder. That's the heat I'm getting. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah, it's good. Let's try a little bit of a little bit of my sauces on it. I was originally sent these by um, by Guar Gum with some. He sent me a bunch of start different sardines and stuff. He sent me these sauces to put on them. So. But I I done those. Those were already done. Excuse me, but I still got this, these sauces left over, so I like to use them when I can. This in here is the uh, Jamaican Choice Triple X Hell Hot Pepper Sauce. We're just going to use it first. See how it goes on here. I, mean, I used this on my other review just recently, and wow, man, it was burning me good. <clears throat> Mm hmm. It goes good on there. And then I got this other Jamaican choice, Calypso hot sauce. This is the one with um, curry in it. Got water, papaya, cayenne, and hot habanero, chili pepper, sugar, onion, cucumber, salt, curry, mustard, spices. It's all kinds of stuff in this. You get the curry pretty pretty well um, Ooh. Wow. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> it goes good on there, too. This is not as not as sweet as this one. But it does have a sweetness to it. And then I got starting to burn a little bit. Then I got the butterlicious, the pineapple bomb hot sauce. You wondering about the dog? The dog is this. <clears throat> the one that makes this stuff is the. Uh, it's the owner of, of a company. Um, well, I think it says, it says on here. Yeah. Premium Mortgage Corporation. And he um, makes a bunch of hot sauces and he names the hot sauces after his employees' pets. This one, the dog just happens, to, his name is Butter. Or her name, his or her name is butter so <clears throat> he named her 
named this Butterlicious. This is a really good one. It's the chunky pineapple. <clears throat> but it's hot. This has, whoa, 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 whoa. It has a lot. Boy, that's really good, but boy, it's hot. Mm. Where's my water? <clears throat> California girl. This is a really good one. Big old chunks in there. Goes good on club crackers. Got a big old piece right there. Woo! Still a lot of sauce in there. And it easily overflows if you're not careful. Okay. I'm going to end it there. It's good. There's a lot of, there's a lot of fish in here. Fish. There's a lot of sardines. Sardine fish. In here. Okay. <clears throat> Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. <clears throat> and I will see you all on the next one. I'll see if I can come up with some more sardines that I haven't tried, but it's getting to the point where it's hard to find sardines I haven't tried. So, um, in the meantime, while I'm looking for some, <clears throat> I got some more microwavable din dinners. Uh, some of you might be getting tired of those, but I found some that I haven't reviewed yet. So, next week, I'll probably be doing those. So, um, some of you like like the microwave dinner reviews. But, uh, yeah, I'm okay. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. See you on the next one.